<laughs> Fuck off, you cunt. What is that? <laughs> Namaste fam, Wolfcore here, and welcome back to Season 2 of Horror and Habaneros. Now after I finished Slender the Arrival, I was not planning on eating any more Habaneros for your entertainment, but things change. And here we are again, we are jumping back into another season of Horror and Habaneros, because honestly, it was one of my best series ever, and I just, I just couldn't let go. I need the pain, I guess I'm a masochist, I don't know! But at any rate, we are going to be playing through another game while eating spicy 3000 Scoville unit habanero peppers and that game is Outlast. Now for today's episode, episode one of season two, I have prepared one, can you see that okay? Habanero pepper, I cut it into quarters. Bear in mind these things are very, very hot. And uh, I dressed it up with a little bit of sriracha and Italian seasoning because you know, if you're gonna do this to yourself, you might as well make it taste good. So that's a thing. This is Outlast. I've never played Outlast before. I watched a little bit of footage of Outlast 2, so I have a vague reference of what the game play is like, but I have no personal experience with the game whatsoever, and uh, we're gonna jump into this blind and have some fun. So come with me, fam. Outlast contains intense violence, gore, graphic sexual content, and strong language. Please enjoy. You are Miles Oopsher, an investigative reporter who whose ambition is about to earn him an intimate tour of hell on Earth. Always willing to risk digging into the stories no one, no other journalist will dare investigate, you will seek out the dark secret at the heart of Mount Massive Asylum. Stay alive as long as you can, record everything. You are not a fighter to navigate the horrors of Mount Massive and expose the truth. Your only choices are to run, hide, or die. Oh boy! Alright fam, here we go. New game. You know what that means, it's time for a habanero pepper. And in tradition, I will start with the largest piece. <laughs> it's the spice. Really brings out the flavor, though. Oh. <coughs> Woo! Okay. 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 Uh, uh, September 17th, 2013. From some email. To me. Subject. Tip. Illegal activity at Murkoff Psychiatric Systems. You don't know me. I have to make this quick. They might be monitoring. Oh. And in two weeks of software consult at Murkoff Psychiatric Systems facilities in Mount Massive. Ooh, I'm getting a phone call from my mom. Mom, I'll call you back later. I love you. <laughs> I did two weeks of software consult at Murkoff Psychiatric Systems facilities in Mount Massive. All sorts of NDAs. I'm very much breaking right now, but serious. Fuck those guys. <clears throat> uh, terrible things happening there. Don't understand it. Don't believe half the things. I saw doctors talking about dream therapy going too deep. Finding something that had been waiting for them in the mountain. People are being hurt and Murkoff is making money. I ne it needs to be exposed. Woo! Woo! That was a journey to get through those sentences. Let me tell you what. Okay. Well, this is a very pretty game. I wasn't expecting it to look so good. Okay. We got a camera. Just like just like in Slender the Arrival. Okay, awesome. Oh, we got night vision. Okay. That's useful. And creepy. Night vision is creepy. Oh, hi. Oh, wow. It's almost like Hogwarts, but not at all. Objectives are updated in your reporter's notebook. Tab. 
containing your notes, N, and pick up documents with J. Okay, whoa, hey, how about you fucking don't? Yeah, it's probably automatic. Probably just an automatic gate. Nothing to be concerned about. Can I go in here? Thank you. Control to crouch. Whoa, you can get way down. But it's like on a delay. You have to hold it. I've never... That's a unique crouch feature. I've never felt a crouch feature like that in a game before. Um, okay. Nothing in here. Hello? Can I jump? I can jump. Oh, you can jump and hurdle over obstacles. Wow. Well, I'm already pleasantly surprised. This feels like a well-designed game. To open a door, quickly press left mouse button to open a door. Hey, hey! Bitch. Don't cut me off in the middle of my readings. To raise your camera, press right mouse button, okay? Okay. Okay, a little, little fear starting to hit me. Event recorded. Added a note in your notebook. Press N to read it. Okay. I start feeling sick just looking at this place. <sighs> Mount Massive Asylum shut down amid scandal and government secrecy in 1971, reopened by Murkoff Psychiatric Systems in 2009 under the guise of a charitable organization. Cell phone reception cut off abruptly a mile out, more like a jammer than lost signal. The Murkoff Corporation has a long track record of disguising profit as charity, but never on American soil. Whatever they thought they could get out of this place has to be a big ha place has to be big. Might finally be the story that breaks the bastard. Awesome. Okay. I'll try and keep up on reading the uh, the notes and the lore that the game presents. Okay, hold shift to run. We got a locked door there. Boy, I cannot see very well. Got a locked door there. I wonder if I need to be concerned about battery life. I really hope not. Oh. Well, these look like some official ass vehicles right here. Oh. Okay. Just got another wave of fire there. Um, seems to be locked. Seems to be locked. Okay. Mount Massive Asylum. Wow, this game is really, really pretty. I gotta say, I was not expecting it to be so darn good looking. Oh. I don't like that. I don't like that. I mean, I know it's just a lamp on its side, but something about it is highly unsettling to me. Oh, hold crouch. Oh, and you can move while you're crouched. Excellent. Excellente. Hmm. Suppose we could stand up. Let's explore the courtyard, and then we'll see what's through that door. With the camcorder active, you can zoom in and out with mouth scroll up and mouth scroll down. Oh. Oh. I like that like that a lot. Boy, I'm enjoying this game already. I mean, I haven't pooped my pants yet, so that's probably a big factor in it, but it just feels nice. It feels like a really well-made game. Oh, here we go. The door was probably locked anyways. To jump over a gap, press spacebar while moving forward. Easy mode. Oh, hurdling obstacles. Like a champ. Like a champion. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Oh, that looks like the way. The way. Oh, I kind of want to know if that door would open, but... Ooh. Ah! 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 Okay, I'm already not liking this a lot. Oh, golly. Oh, and there is a battery on my camera, so I actually have to keep moving. Okay, so if I get got by something, if I get got, I have to eat another slice of habanero. In case you're new to the Horror and Habanero series, that is how we play. Janet. Gently. 
Sneaky, sneaky. Sneaky, sneaky boy. I'm a sneaky boy. Oh man, that is burning. That is burning through my batteries quick. Come on, no! Come on, no! What the fuck was that? Was that just the TV? Didn't care for that. Oh, is that blood up there? Oh, fuck me. Oh. Come on, come on, get through. Oh god, I'm scared. I'm scared. And the the rough thing is, is I know I'm scared for good reason. I'm... Oh. You know what I mean? It's like, this is a horror game. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, there's gonna be a jump scare. There's gonna be a jump scare soon. And that's the part that scares me the most. Ooh. Ooh. Hi. What's this? A patient age, 19, gender, male. Observing physician, Dr. Carl... Houston. Houston? Houston? Hmm. Therapy status. Patient claims to have progressed to self-directed lucid dream states. Morphogenic engine activity observed at unprecedented scale. Continuing stage 4 hormone schedule. Diagnostics. Uh, spiro spirometry revealed no bron bronchial accumulation. Hem uh, hemor hemato hematocritic Hemiotocrit centrifuge again failed to separate erythroct. Why the fuck can't you just spell words in a way that are easy to read? Jeez! Why do doctors have to make everything so wordy? Did you hear that? I think I heard some. Well, those are footprints. I mean, I don't know what else I was expecting, but those are definitely footprints. Fuck. Can you take this as a weapon? No. No, you're not a fighter. I remember that now. a body up there and there's a ramp leading to oh my gosh this is horrifying this is actually horrifying okay we should check that door right what the fuck is that what the hell is that oh oh man that door is gonna be locked and I'm gonna have to climb through the vent I know it that's locked That's locked. All right, enjoy your poop. Enjoy your poop, good sir or madame. Seem to be a unisex bathroom. <laughs> oh, fucking spider webs, gross. Oh, please don't find me. Okay, okay, we got through the terrifying crawl space. Library. Well, shall we see what's in the library? <laughs> ah! Fuck off, you cunt. <sighs> That is a body. Oh. Fuck. He's missing his head. Awesome. Son of a biscuit. This looks like we can climb through there.
Okay. Pool of blood. Perfectly. Ah, no, no. You pull that back out. Now, please. Okay. I thought I saw a little a little space that we could crawl through. Did I imagine that? Can we crawl through there? No, we cannot crawl through the bookshelf. God, that got me. Oh. Oh, it's open, though. Motherfucker, I cannot see a gosh darn thing in here. This is actually horrifying. This is actually horrifying. Oh, oh, oh please. Beautiful. Beautiful. That's what I want. Oh, and there's heads stacked up against the wall. Fucking gorgeous. Oh. They killed us. They got out. The variants. You can't fight them. You have to hide. You can unlock the main doors from security control. Oh! You have to get the fuck out of this terrible place. Okay. I'm leaving. I'm gonna go back to my jeep now. Oh man. Oh my word. Ah, heads. Hi. Hi. Uh, hi. Hi, beautiful. You're looking peaky. So there should be a door right around here somewhere, right? Jeez. Here we go. Found it. Found the door. Okay, beautiful. Okay, we're fine. Nope, we're gonna need that on. Alright, fam, nobody seems to be getting me, so we're gonna eat another quarter of a habanero. In the hopes that it will stave off the demons! The demons! <laughs> Hot. Okay, well, the pain in my mouth is distracting me from the horror in my mind, so that's, you know, I got that going for me, which is nice. Oh, there's a fan down there. It scared me for a second. All right. All right. What's the big idea here? Let's start checking these doors. Okay, we're locked. We're locked. We've got some mustache in my mouth. Let's move that. That's blocked. What do we have here, though? Ooh. Man, it is so dark. Hard to reload batteries. Oh, will that make my night vision work good again? Oh, there we go. <coughs> <coughs> oh, that's painful. Oh, beautiful. Human hand in the turret. Fantastic. Hey, need a hand? <coughs> okay. So, nothing in there. <coughs> Oh, okay. So there is a little shortcut over here. Squeeze through here. Ah! <laughs> Fuck off! Who the hell are you? Oh my god! <gasps> no! No! And who are you? Well, you can call me Wolfgore. I... I see. Merciful God, you have sent me an apostle. Guard your life, son. You have a calling. No. 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 
No. No. No. Well, my God, that was a shocking first episode. I didn't see how long I recorded for, but it felt like a good time to call it an episode. That genuinely scared the shit out of me. And oh my God. That was fun, though. That was fun. I'm really enjoying the game. It looks like it's really well made, well put together. I like it. Feels good, man. And uh, it's definitely scary. The jump scares are perfect. It, I think I screamed at least three times, which is fantastic. That's, you know, what I want to happen. So tell me it, down below if you guys enjoyed the episode. And uh, yeah, look forward to episode two coming out soon. And uh, thank you all so much for watching. I love your faces. You ever seen guns like these? <laughs> Anyways, yeah, make sure you like the video to support the channel. Make sure you leave comments supporting the content creator and uh, telling, telling me how hot I am. Yeah, I know. <laughs> God damn, I'm disgustingly hot. Oh, yeah. And uh, did I forget anything? Oh, and uh, be sure to share on social media. We really like that over here at the uh, Wolf Door LLC. Thank you, fam. See you next time. Bye-bye.